a little farther along down the processing scale is roving. Roving is carted into a rope that's about two to three inches wide. The fibers are mostly going in the same direction and they still have their natural crimp. Now, a step before this is called a sliver where it's very similar to roving, but whereas a sliver is just the wool processed into this rope, Roving takes it one step farther by adding a slight twist into the construction of this rope. This allows for a very easy transition from roving into spinning. But roving, slivers, whatever you are using, whether it has a slight twist or not, can be used for needle felting and wet felting as well. A lot of roving come in beautiful hand dyed or commercial dyed colors, so make sure to take a look at all of the different types of roving available to you.